This month, the site director for the Elizabeth Ney Museum in Austin passed away at 60 years old. And today, dozens of people came to honor, her, honor Oliver Franklin's life on the grounds of the museum that houses the world's largest collection of women's work. Photojournalist Mariana Garza takes us there. I'm going to open first with a poem. It's called Adrift, and it is by Mark Nepo. I am honestly overwhelmed at the community that's come out for this event. I know how much he loved this place and for so much of this part of Austin to be out here celebrating with him a week after his passing, it's just overwhelming. Everything is beautiful and I am so sad. I, I could not replace this moment with anything. Um, this place meant so much to him and for him to be remembered and appreciated. Look at all these people and how much they're enjoying this and how important this is to this town. I'm just amazed. The breeze makes the birds move from branch to branch as this ache makes me look for those I've lost in the next room, in the next song, in the laugh of the next stranger. I think his message was everybody matters, everyone's point of view matters, everybody has something to contribute to their community, and here's the place where it's allowed. I am so sad and everything is beautiful.